Anyway, but three of the things in that book were in the campaign. October 12th. Kind of hard to argue with that. It's pretty simple. And I opened my PR. <laughs> okay, so now, now it's time for a little video thing. And so now this is a little slideshow. And then I'm going to play the slideshow and then we're going to talk about it. And then I'll do another little slideshow. I knew I got it right. The slideshow is the rapture show. The first slideshow. The first slideshow was the, uh, the, it's the fire show. The next slideshow is the one that he's getting ready to do. And then they're going to talk about it. Because that slideshow is going to happen on Sunday, 2.30 a.m. Monday, he's going to come back and make the Mark of the Beast video. So let me let him explain that to you. Kind of hard to argue with that. It's pretty simple. <laughs> okay, so now, now it's time for a little video thing. And so now this is a little slideshow. And then I'm going to play the slideshow and then we're going to talk about it. Then I'll do another little slideshow. And uh, that'll be our Friday night hanging out together. Oh, and by Friday night hanging out together. Okay. So he's going to do one slideshow and then another little slideshow, three in a row. The first slideshow is the fire, the Rex T-Rex over there in California. Next slideshow is the rapture. Then the other slideshow is the missiles coming from uh, Iran. Iran, the missiles would be coming from there. But that's his slideshow, the second 9-11. Slideshow. And then I'm going to play the slideshow. And then I'll do another little slideshow. Now it's time for a little video thing. And so now this is a little slideshow. See, when he talks like that, he's obviously trying to hide something. When he stutters his words like purposely. So... He's always, man, it's just best if you just stop doing videos and I won't be able to Joe, figure you out. And then I'm going to play the slide. Kind of hard to argue with that. It's I, pretty simple. I, I agree. It is. <laughs> okay, so it now, is. now it's time for a little video thing. And so right there. Now this is a little slideshow. And then I'm going to play the slideshow, and then we're going to talk about it. Then I'll do another little slideshow. He's going to play the slideshow, the rapture. Then we're going to talk about it, because this is Sunday. This is Monday. And then we're, we're going to play another little slideshow. And uh, that'll be our Friday night hanging out together. Oh. So Friday night. Friday is uh uh hold on let's uh it just everything everything really is perfection when you're doing it truthfully All right. that's 2013. october let's see Today's the 12th. Okay, so Friday. Friday. After. He's going to play a slideshow. Because he already played one. Four, three, two, one. There's a. There's a two, three bypass. And there's a slideshow that's going to be played. Then he's going to talk about it, and there's going to be another slideshow. And then, one, two, three, or from here, one, two, three, and a half. Either way, Friday is the uh, 
Friday is the, the cutoff. That's the cutoff. Is that not 150 days from May 21st? The 150 days from May 21st, landing on October 18th. Well, it is. Okay, so now, now it's time for a little video thing. And so now this is a little slideshow. And then I'm going to play the slideshow, and then we're going to talk about it. Then I'll do another. We're going to talk about it. We're going to play the slideshow on Sunday, because Monday he's coming with the Mark of the Beast video, which will be in between it. And then he's going to play another one. Another little slideshow. And uh, that'll be our Friday night hanging out together. Yeah, because from that point on, there's three and a half days. Unless, well, uh... So, let's see. Hmm. He's definitely going to make the Mark of the Beast video, Monday. And then Friday, he plans on hanging out. I don't know. I mean, maybe the rapture is October 18th. Wait a minute. Why do I keep changing my mind? Damn it, it is October 18th. Shit, look at that. I was just five months ahead. Pray that your flight isn't when you believe the lie. The rapture. The rapture. May 18th, October 18th. Just add the five months. Yeah, so the, the party starts. The party starts the 18th, which is when the water is completely sealed tight, dried in. Woohoo! You know? Woohoo! Lilith. Eve. He claims to be Eve. He says he wants to come down with his angels and have sex with the 144,000 and then kill them. Is he serious? Like, I mean, I know he claims to be Lucifer in the flesh, and he's showing his authority that he has. You know, he's showing more authority than Steve. I'll give him that. He's, I mean, he kind of gives himself away even in a different way than Steve does. But I just, with Steve, there's something different that's, he just seems more intelligent than this guy. This guy's freaking straight delusional. But whatever, he's been promised to reign and rule. But he has two more slideshows to show. He's Laser Johnny Beam. And him, Hil Hillary, and... And, um... What's his name? O Obama. You know, so far they seem like those three dirty frogs that, that comes out of the mouth. Oh, and by the way... Then, um, like, Sunday or maybe Sunday or Monday, I'm going to deliver the Mark of the Beast video. Yeah, you know, I mean, it's just, it's it's phenomenal knowledge. It but sure is. I want you to know all this first. So, if you have... I already do know all this first. You understand? There are polar opposites of each other. Satan. God. Darkness, light, evil, good, down, up. Your time is up. Oh, well, no shit, Johnny. I've been telling you when my time is up. My time is up. Five months past this time is up. Hey, I came here not to turn things upside down, you freaking bozo to clown. I came here to turn your frown upside down.
understand? They are polar opposites of each other. Satan, God, darkness, light, evil, good, down, up. Your time is up. Kind of hard to argue with that. It's pretty simple. <laughs> okay, so now, now it's time for a little video thing. And so now this is a little slideshow. And then I'm going to play the slideshow and then we're going to talk about it. Then I'll do another little slideshow. And uh, that'll be our Friday night hanging out together. And so he's doing the first slideshow. And he's going to talk about it. He's going to do another slideshow. And then Friday will be the hangout. Friday is the waters are completely abated. October 18th. They're abated. Then, but he's saying he's going to deliver the Mark of the Beast video on Monday, or Sunday or Monday. But I know how he likes to um, try to jump ahead. But he's really talking about now. He's trying to jump to the future, make you think it's after Friday, then there's Sunday and Monday, right? Isn't that the 18th and then the 20th and the 21st? Sunday and Monday? It is. However, when he is referring to the first video and then talk about it in the second, and he's saying Sunday and Monday, and I'm already connecting the dots with Sunday the, the rapture event, the angel rapture event going up and down. And then Monday, the second 9-11, because it's the 14th, Hillary Clinton sending missiles. She's rocketing into third place, according to Dabu 7. They're all referencing those three unclean frogs that need to, uh, they just need to go. They need to get drained, the swamp. That's why... This guy talks in circles and he tries to jump ahead or he'll talk about feet when he's really talking about days, a certain amount of feet, a certain amount of yards, whatever, the, the measurements. Oh, and by the way, then um, like Sunday or maybe Sunday or Monday. Now he's jumping back. And this is how the Bible is written too. You go all Revelation up, up to chapter 19 and read it and then chapter 20 jumps back eight years ago to may 21st 2011 it jumps back the thousand year period that one day just stopping and ignorant of this one thing that that one day is as with the lord a thousand years a thousand years is as one day he's heading back to the sunday and monday that's yet to come I'm going to deliver the Mark of the Beast video. Now, for any reason that it's that it's not this Sunday and it's not this Monday, the 13th and the 14th, if for some reason it ain't, well, then it would be continued for exactly one week. Everything that I've said would be continued for one week. If none of this stuff happens this week and the 18th, you don't hear me anymore, then just know that I'm in jail for, I don't know what what they're going to charge me with. If if the 9-11 doesn't happen this Monday, well, then you can't charge me with the conspiracy of it. But if it does happen this Monday, well, then there's a better chance that that could happen. But remember, Cleck, I'm leaving this part up to God. I didn't go this far and get prepared this much and come after you as much as I am now because I'm wasting my time. I just dig deep and I get people to react. Only if I would have known from the beginning how much attention I've gotten to the elite, then I, don't know, I guess it wouldn't have 
taking me that long to figure this out, but now we're at the end here. You're a lion. You're lying. You are 100% lying. You are a lying. Your mouth is going to be shut. I'm going to shut your mouth. That frown is going to get turned upside down. You even said it that... Total bozo. By the way, bozo's a clown. Is it a dead sheep? Well, let's, let's on a crino. Let's turn it up. So we turn it up. It's a... All right. I'm just going to do my commentary and let you know what I know that he's thinking. What I know what he's saying. What I know is in his heart. What he's promised. Here's what he's saying. He is Eve. Him and his angels, the fallen angels, they want to have sex with virgins, the virgin women. The virgins represent 144,000, obviously. Obviously. And then he wants to kill the sheep. So he wants to have sex with 144,000 and then kill them. The sheep. So why does the virgin equal a dead sheep? That is the million dollar question. Because Eve and a bunch of angels wanting to have sex with virgins killed all the sheep, which were the angels. Mystery solved. And now let's go back to 1 Corinthians. Ready? Boom. Okay, so let's finish 1 Corinthians is that not what you got out of the that what I seen there? What I'm hearing? Is it is are you getting something different that he's not trying to Im, at least imply? All right. I'll give him that. He could be acting, but at least he's implying those exact words. Is he not? Do you have a different uh perception of what he just said? Or is it the same exact perception as mine? Too. Now watch. But he that is spiritual judgeth all things, yet he himself is Here's judged how he of explains no man. how he's God. So look at this verse. But he that is spiritual, non-carnal. See right here? I'm going to highlight that. Non-carnal. John Clay. That is humanly ethereal as opposed to gross. Okay, so divinely supernatural regenerate. He that is spiritual judgeth all things. Look at the word judgeth. Anacrino again. Anacrino. To distinguish by vigorously judging down to up. So see, this is everything right now, guys. So he that is spiritual judgeth. Anacrino. There all he things. Is. Yet he himself is judged of no man. So all those false prophet channels... <laughs> All those lunatics, and I do, God have mercy on them. If they thought they were crazy now, wait till they get stuck in a dimension that is eternal horror. Because they've condemned themselves with their own tongues. That's why when I prayed at the beginning of this, uh, you know, video, it's like, I, I don't hate those people. As a matter of fact, I wish I could fix it for them. I would if I could, but they were obviously predestined for the end they met, especially the ones that are such lunatics that they persist in doing more videos one after another. <laughs> That's just a demon sh because it's like doubling down on everything they yeah. have to. They have no choice. Yeah, that ain't me, right? Anyway, so there. Now look at this. Oh, man. So he that is spiritual judgeth How all easy things Anacrina vigorously discerning from down to up. Yet he himself is judged Anacrina of no man. For who hath known the mind That's of only the Lord four that days he may ago. instruct him? But we have the mind of Christ. Look, who hath known? It means to know absolutely, look at this, the mind. It means the intellect, divine or human in thought. But look what it comes from. To know absolutely. Who has known the mind, the intellect, that you know absolutely of the Lord, that he may instruct him. But we That's have only the in mind. Seven days. Look at that. The mind. False prophet channels. All those lunatics. And I do mean God have mercy on them. If they thought they were crazy now, wait till they get stuck in a dimension 
they've condemned themselves with their own tongues. That's why when I prayed at the beginning of this, uh, you know, video, it's that like, ministry? I, I don't hate those people. As a matter of fact, I wish I could fix it for them. I would if I could, but... I don't need you to fix it. They anything. were obviously predestined for the end they met, especially the ones that are such lunatics that they... For the end they met. Met is... That place where Madonna is going, it's right It's right on Broad Street, right before the, uh, it's like right there near the, the, uh, the convention center, Met. Because they've condemned themselves with their own tongues. That's why when I prayed at the beginning of this, uh, you know, video, it's like, I, I don't hate those people. As a matter of fact, I wish I could fix it for them. I would if I could, but they were obviously predestined for the end they met. Especially the ones that are such lunatics that they persist in doing more videos one after another. That's just a demon. Because it's like doubling down on everything they have to. They have no choice. Anyway, so there. Now look at this. So he that is spiritual judgeth all things. Anacrino vigorously discerning from down to up. Here, Jonathan's going to tell us how he is the only one with the intellect as a divine God. Look what it comes from. To know absolutely who has known the mind, the intellect that you know absolutely of the Lord, that he may instruct him. But we have the mind. Look at that. The mind. We have the intellect and the absolute knowing of Christ, see the anointed one. So how is it? I mean, now here's the quiz. How is it that you know that you know that you know that you have the mind of Christ? Everybody see this. And then I, I pray and I decide. It's a no brainer. Well, super important. That All you got to do is turn it from down to up. All the time is now. Just and distinguish what you're looking at. So I do. So anyway, so let me show you something that y'all don't know. So can you be saved? Not only Without is this a T Rex that everything's up to that we're gonna be eating right no there. pleasant so yes, but bread the back of the T Rex or any kind of pleasant like tea is wine also or anything like that it's impossible for a certain it's amount of days. And you have to know the truth. I'm not gonna say how many again. days, it's just there's a certain amount of days that you free because this is the law. This is the truth. But here's a T Rex. And now look this at the is dark. Those around. days that this is so as the body comes around, this is evil. In between see that the back of the T Rex comes around, yeah, and they're, they're going to probably lift the box of me up first. I mean, that uh, is because just when that happens, Satan, it's like, what the hell? hell? God, I'm okay, telling now, you, now, dark, I'm telling you, you, you where I got the information. Mainly from John Evil. But I know he's representing Barack Obama's ex buddy. And I know Hillary Clinton is in one of his ex buddies. Kind of his buddy. They're all playing parts okay, well, of the Bible as the Antichrist. Hillary's playing the, uh, the, the queen, the whore that sits on the mountains with the scarlet. That's what they're pushing for her to be back in the Bible. In the Bible. Playing up the prophecy. Okay, so now. Now it's time for a little video. The reptilian part of the Now this is a little slide. Each part show. reptile, but and the whole then thing. I'm going to play serpent. the slideshow, okay, and then we're going to talk about. It. Then I'll do okay. another now, little slideshow. We're going to go to album and, uh, four, which is in, night, out which is that's in, the victory, uh, oh, October eighteenth. Then um, like I'm Sunday or maybe, maybe Sunday or Monday. Popping back in time, thirteenth or fourteenth. Have you typed that to Google? This is in four three two. Boom shakalaka. Second nine eleven. You know, I mean, it's just it's it's. Phenomenal right knowledge. Like Damn sure is. I want you to know all this first. I already so know. if you have a triangle like <laughs> Shut this, the F up. right? And remember, Satan is the capstone, the all-seeing eye, right? 
Right, so right. So if you that flip you? it upside down, then you have an upside down triangle. That makes an X, doesn't it? So if you have it like this, and then you go boom, and you just keep that pivot point at the top. All right, so as of right now, as of right now, he's at 57 minutes. I still, I didn't get to, this is as far as I got with his video, 57.10. So I'm just going to watch it live with you and do some commentary. And you just go, boom, well, you have a right side up and upside down triangle touching at the tips. It makes an X. That's what was on my parachute. Now, touching at the tips kind of sounds like a missile. Isn't it funny? X marks the spot. Yeah. You son of a bitch. Oh, my goodness. Oh, it is. Oh, oh click. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> He's funny. I remember saying X marks the spot. Philadelphia. Hey, you remember X marks the spot? Oh, man. Let me put this charger in here. Wow. It's something else. He just, Everything he says is just he's literally giving himself away. But I know he kind of... I know he wants to. He, like, he wants me to fear him. But it's literally impossible to, because I actually experience what it's like to have God whoop my ass, and then understand that okay, I can't, I can't go. I just, I'm sorry, God, you know. But no, you're not, you're not. So X marks the spot. Let's see where does where does that sound familiar at? With X marking the spot. X, it looks like the 911. This one right here with the Tyrannosaurus Rex on it. Sperm forbidden. 848. 848. I actually read this in the last video. I skipped right by it. I, I did too. Like, I did the same thing, don't Robin. Me. Be still and know that I am God. 911. 848 duplicate of Daniel 12 is what click is here's the eagle being left behind by the Navy Air Force military but remember it's an open sky treaty Here's what's coming up. The scariest movie ever. The 10 day horror film. I, I, I need a confirmation that that's what you want me to do. And so. And then the, the Lord one, said. Two, three confirmations in a row. And I was like. So now we've got three in a row. Here. There's the Lord. Okay, there's three in a row now. We're waiting. We're weighing it out. He got confirmation from Steve. Pennsylvania. And so I got one, two, three confirmations in a row. Hey, hey, um, Henry Windsor, are you the one that sent the letters? And I was like, and I was like, I was like okay. Steve, <laughs> Robin is so difficult to bring down. You give me so much work. Alright, comes. As he's showing the Antichrist, he wants to show you his face real quick. Now, remember, I, want, I just want to comment very Before quickly. your eyes. Remember, in the Bible, the word man, Adam. Remember, in the Bible, the word man, Adam. In the root 119, it's Hebrew word 120, it comes from 119, which means red. Rapture red? Blood red? 9-11, second 9-11 red? And ready to, to show blood in the face. They all do it in sequence. Let's see, is the Robert T. Staff for the Robert T. Staff? You have it like this, and then you go, boom, and you just keep that pivot point at the top, and you just go, boom, well, you have a right side up and upside down triangle touching at the tips. It makes an X. That's what was on my parachute. Isn't it funny, X marks the spot? Yeah. Okay, because 
when I get into the whole Mark of the Beast stuff, I want y'all to already have this knowledge that we're talking about tonight, okay? Because then the Mark of the Beast video will blow your mind. Okay, so here we go. Blow Let's do this one. Up. Ready? Strong's Concordance Definitions. Now, before I play this little slideshow, let me just tell you. These are only some, not near all. But when the Lord taught me to use the concordance to break down what they're doing, like 7-Up. There's a drink called 7-Up. So it sounds like there's there's more, but not that he didn't give us all. Is there more, Johnny, to come? Mind. Okay, so here we go. Let's do this one. I want you to know all this first. So if you have a triangle like this, right? And remember, Satan is the capstone, the all-seeing eye, right? So if you flip it upside down, then you have an upside down triangle. That makes an X, doesn't it? So if you have it like this, and then you go boom, and you just keep that pivot point the top, and you just go boom, well, you have a right side up and upside down triangle touching at the tips. Yeah, that sounds exactly like a missile. That's exactly what it sounds like he's explaining. Doesn't it? So if you have it like this, and then you go boom, and you just keep that pivot point the top, and you just go boom. Well, you have a right side up and upside down triangle touching at the tips. It makes an X. That's what was on my parachute. And it funny X marks the spot. Yeah. Damn sure. Okay, because when I get into the whole mark of the beast stuff, I want y'all to already have this knowledge that we're talking about tonight. Okay, because then the mark of the beast video will blow your mind. Okay, so here we go. Let's do this one. Ready? Strong's Concordance Definitions. Now, before I play this little slideshow, let me just tell you. These are only some, not near all. But when the Lord taught oh, me to images. use the concordance to break down what they're doing, like 7-Up. There's a drink called 7-Up. Do you know why they named it 7-Up? The number seven means to destroy, to kill. Oh. Yeah, well, my number seven to means... To destroy, kill. Shut up. My number seven means means absolute, perfect, complete perfection. That's what it truly means. You can use it whatever way you want, but seven is complete perfection. Seven days.